So students, this is the video number eight of chapter three, laws of motion, ninth standard physics. In the previous video, we discussed about the types of non-contact forces and contact forces. The types of non-contact forces are first is this gravitational force second is electrostatic force and third is magnetic force Now we will discuss in detail about the contact forces. First is the frictional force. First contact force is force of friction. Now friction force is a self adjusting force. Suppose this is a table top and here is one book lying on the top surface of the table. If I will push it or pull it in this way, this is the force, external force, applied force. Then there is a force of friction, especially static friction. Force of friction will develop in opposite way. First we have to overcome this force of friction, then only this book will come in motion. Otherwise this book will remain at rest. Second is normal reaction force normal reaction force same example I'll consider for this also here is the again table top one book you can consider on its surface this book weight is lying downward weight is acting downward and table top will exert a force of reaction normal reaction normal so easily it can balance this force third one is force of tension So for that, one string we can consider and one end of the string will be tied to this box, massive box, whose weight is acting downward. And here is the force of tension which is acting in upward direction towards the point of suspension which is equal to weight of body if I will cut it from this point very near to this box suspended end from here then this string will feel a force in upward direction because of this tension ultimately after some time it will come down due to its own weight fourth one is that is force exerted by spring now force exerted by spring we can discuss yeah. 
फोर्स एक्सर्टेड बाय अ स्प्रिंग फॉर दिस केस विद दिस रिजर्व स्पोर्ट वी कैन imagine one of the end of this spring is attached to this rigid support and from the other end we'll pull it to the right side so what we'll feel there is a storing force storing force which acts in opposite direction so this storing force is exerted due to the spring action of this spring fifth one is forces exerted during collision now for that you can consider two bodies a and b a is coming towards right side and b is coming towards left side now when they will collide a and b fab is the force acted to this side fab this is the force on a due to b and to the other side we'll have a b a force force on b due to a and overall the result of the collision will be a will start moving to this side and b will start moving to the other side so that is only because of collision after collision both will experience force in opposite direction last part is about non contact forces non contact forces in this non contact forces first is gravitational force gravitational force this gravitational force is always attractive in nature this is very important property of gravitational force and in universe each particle attracts the other particle due to its mass so this force is exerted due to mass more will be the massive body more will be the gravitational force of that body for example that ball attracted towards earth when it is thrown in vertically upward direction a coin also falls down when it is released at a height second is electrostatic force electrostatic force is because are due to the charge it can be attractive as well as repulsive in nature like charges always repel each other unlike charges always attract each other
like charges means positive positive negative negative unlike charges means both are of opposite nature for example when comb is rubbed comb is rubbed on dry hairs that comb will get electrified electrified means get charged and comb can easily attracts the small bits of paper small bits of paper third is magnetic force third is magnetic force so two like magnetic poles repel and two unlike magnetic poles attract each other so this force can also be attractive as well as repulsive in nature like poles north north south south repel each other unlike poles attract each other so in lower classes we have done so many examples for this small iron nail can easily attracted towards a magnet so number of magnetic materials are there you can learn it with this word alnico which is used to make the magnets al for aluminium ni for nickel and co for cobalt these all are magnetic materials will be attracted towards a magnet so this is all about the a part of the chapter 3 laws of motion so just revise the content from the book also it will be easy for you to understand all the types of the forces contact and non contact forces that's all for this video thank you very much